All right, welcome to the course. My name is John Elder from Codemy.com and I'll be your instructor today. In this video, I wanna spend just a minute or two talking about some sort of things we need to talk about before we get into the course and start actually learning this stuff. Uh, first thing I wanna mention is questions. If you have any questions along the way, if you don't understand something, if you try something and it doesn't quite work, if you get stuck, if you're just lost, shoot me a message anytime. I'm here all day, every day answering questions, sort of what I do. And uh, I'll be happy to walk you through absolutely anything. So I'm located in Las Vegas, um, West Coast time, Pacific Standard Time, whatever. So if you're on the other side of the world, just sort of keep that in mind when you sort of factor in response time. You know, I'll answer it as quickly as I can during, you know, normal business hours. I'm here a lot in the evenings as well answering questions. But, you know, if it's two in the morning or something, you just have to wait till the, <laughs> till the next day when I wake up to get an answer. But for the most part, I try and respond just as quick as I can. Uh, what else? I'm on a Windows computer. If you're on a Windows computer, that's great. If you're not, if you're on a Linux or a Mac computer, you should be just fine. You should be able to, be able to follow along with no problems. Uh, PG Admin is a browser-based solution. So it'll work on any web browser on any computer, Windows, Linux, Mac, doesn't matter. It's just gonna be a, a matter of downloading Postgres on your computer. And there are Linux, Mac, and Windows versions for that. We'll see that in the, in the next video. Uh, so you shouldn't have any problem there at all. We're going to be working locally. We're going to have everything on our local computer. I'm not going to set up any sort of web server, nothing online. Uh, you know, obviously, you're going to probably in the future want to use an online web server. That's beyond the scope of this course. In this course, I'm just going to be teaching you, uh, you know, Postgres itself with the PG Admin sort of uh, interface, I guess. And... Uh, so we can do, you know, all that locally. The good thing is locally and up on a web server, it's not much different. You're still going to be interacting with it with the same browser front end solution. So uh, everything we learn in this course will be ap applicable when you actually, you know, get online and start doing this in real time with web servers. We're just not going to focus on that part of this. So I think that's it. In the next video, we're going to jump in and download Postgres.